Hey everyone, I woke up to a more crazy government world. First it was Florida going all nearly willy with all these things that they're doing and losing people in Florida. Now New York City wants to do the same thing. They are placing free vending machines in every city or, um, or every borough, I mean. <laughs> yeah, I said vending machines and people right now probably say, but that's okay. No. They're putting crack pipe vending machines for free. So when I hear the government putting something for free, that just tells me our tax money is getting all spent on dumb things again. And again, you're wasting people's tax money without even asking if you can use it. But the people are letting the government do whatever they want and forgetting that the government works for us. They need permission. But, yes, you heard it from me. New York Post has posted it up today that they have placed a new vending machine. And then they had the nerves to have someone, a black guy, take the first crack pipe out of the vending machine and, and put it in the air. And everybody was clapping like that was something great. The government has been trying to hold people down for so long. But now they are doing it with much, much uh, power, uh, full ways, much um, ways in front of you because they noticed since the pandemic that people are actually noticing more that if you combine together, you become one powerful force. So they do not want that. So they want to keep everything down, keep the people down by giving them free crack pipes. Why, Mayor, instead of giving free crack pipes, you just don't give more ways to get off a of crack. Wouldn't that sound better? You'll have more better citizens for New York City. I don't know. That's just me. That's my, me thinking. I know it's not an easy thing to do because some of them that if they don't want to get off drugs, they won't. I understand that. But at least you gave them the opportunity. Not the opportunity to say, hey, stay on crack. I'm even going to help you out and give you free crack pipes. That doesn't work that way. And you saying it's because of safety reasons or stuff like that. Ain't one person yet that I heard went into the store and said, give me your crack pipes. I want to smoke. Never heard that. Never heard it. And I've been living in New York for a long time since I was born, you know. But this is the world that we are going through right now. Then New York Post posted up a grandma. They want to make sure you know she's a grandma of nine kids, six uh grandkids so and I'm, I'm going to quote this i'm sorry six kids nine grandchildren and she said every time i pull on it meaning puff on the crack pipe it is so thin it is burning my lips i was like hell no my, i like my lips too much for this so she does not want those free crack pipes Hell no, I love my lips too much. Lady, you're not loving your life, but you're loving your lips? Come on. This is why they, 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 they tug on the stability of people that it is getting crazy. So let's try to get this back together. Let's try to figure out a better way to live our lives here. The government is going crazy. The world is going crazy. You got kids want to be adults and fight adults. And then you got adults that want to be like kids and crying all this. And, you know, I'm offended and all this other stuff that they're doing. Let's bring back the way we used to live. When the community were together and it took a village to raise a kid, but you raised the kid well. We didn't have that when we were young. I didn't have, or we didn't have kids want to fight uh, teachers all day, every day in, in some of these schools, even though they were bad schools out there. I'm not saying they were good schools, but they were bad schools. But the one thing you never heard was killing in schools. There was no mass shootings in, of schools. But since you took the rights of a parent to parent their kids, this is what happens. Again, another way the government keeps us down.
Hey, this is a little bit of Speak Out. Hope you enjoyed it. Listen to my podcast on the LDMRadio.com or you can check us out on iHeartRadio. See ya.